forget Barack Obama and the Queen, the most important visitor we've had to our shores is definitely Victoria Beckham. Today she touched down to meet her fans and expose at Brown Thomas in Dublin. There was huge excitement in Brown Thomas in Dublin as Victoria Beckham jetted in to launch her latest collections. This is one of the first stores ever to stock her clothes and sales have soared, much to Victoria's delight. I mean, it's doing really, really well. Uh, Brown Thomas have been um, one of my retail partners right since the beginning. So to be here and support them um, and, and just meet people, I'm, I'm quite overwhelmed. The turnout is absolutely incredible. She's done a lot of travelling lately and admits she brings baby Harper, number four in her brood, everywhere. So how does she balance work and motherhood? It, it definitely has its challenges. As I've said before, it's a bit like juggling glass balls, you know. Um, but there's lots of mums out there that are busy and have a family as well. So I'm so blessed to have the family that I have and be doing what I love to do. In the flesh, Victoria's very svelte and, as you'd expect, super stylish too. But her look today was quite relaxed. She arrived with baby Harper in tow and I just thought it was oh so cute and the fact that she wasn't immaculately groomed to a tee, it, it, it won me over in a way. I would have liked to see her wear some colour maybe, just because despite the weather it is summer, but she looked like Victoria Beckham. Victoria's won prestigious awards for her designs and from the Spice Girls, there's no doubt she's now a fully fledged fashionista. I think what's incredible is that everybody was so sceptical about her in the beginning because we just all saw her as a socialising celebrity, how could she possibly do this? and pull it off and the fact that she's into her seventh season and that it's growing from strength to strength it really is quite an achievement it certainly is and fair play to her we say